Hey everyone, I'm back and uh, I said I was going to do Inception on my last video, but uh, I have a bit of a change of plans, uh -huh. and that's going to be, my new plans are, I'm reviewing Game Night and Annihilation now, and I'll do Inception some other time, because I am uh, pretty far behind, and if you saw my channel update, and if you've been following following me on Twitter, you know what happened. But if you want to see uh, what my the movies that I've seen already, you can download the Stardust app. All the movies I've seen are on the Stardust app, and you can see my reactions. And follow me there. Uh, my username is going to be in the description down below. So download it, follow me there, and. You'll know what I've seen. But, let's get into Game Night. And before we continue, uh, I just need to point one thing out. I saw this and Annihilation. And I've seen basically only one good movie so far this year. And it ain't this one. So, the plot to Game Night is... Uh, uh, Jason Bateman's character uh, meets uh, with uh, this other uh, actress, I forgot her name. These two are obsessed with Game Night, and what they do is they're interested in Game Night, and they love uh, board games and anything that involves games, basically speaking. And um, one night, uh, bad stuff happens, and... If you've seen the trailer, you know what to expect. If you haven't seen the trailer, don't. I don't like it. So, let's go to the positives. I'm gonna try and stay positive because this isn't the worst movie I've seen all year. I'm not saying... That's not saying a whole lot, but it's something. Uh, there are some uh, good performances in this movie. Uh, Jason Bateman's good. Uh, the stuff you saw in the trailers is the best stuff in the movie, and it's actually funny. That's another thing. Uh, there are some other jokes that work. Aside from that, this movie sucked. I didn't really laugh at anything else. Uh, the cinematography is bland. Uh, there's nothing interesting, visually speaking. The dialogue isn't very good. Uh, the acting, generally speaking, isn't great, but everyone's trying, you know? But the plot itself is kind of stupid and uh, doesn't really make a whole lot of, a whole lot of sense but it's a comedy so things don't necessarily have to make sense but the comedy you don't know about uh, that wasn't shown in the trailers uh, it doesn't really work so yeah. uh, I'm trying to not just say that this movie just wasn't funny for me and I know a lot of people like this movie over Annihilation, and I don't have a big problem with that at, really at all, because comedy, or sorry, humor is very subjective. You either like it or you don't like it, and for myself, it just wasn't funny. I think it was also the pacing for the humor that was also a problem because I was always ahead of the humor, and uh, I think that was another problem. Uh, it's not very well paced out. The music in this movie, um, I, like, barely remember it. I get why people like this movie. Uh, if uh, the trailer looked funny to you, uh, go see it. If you're just looking to kill some time, and you like Jason Bateman as an actor, go see it. That's my recommendation. <laughs> uh, if you did not like Office Christmas Party, don't go see this movie. Uh, I enjoyed it, but I, I don't know what happened here. And I'm just going to give... Game Night, a D plus. I get why people like it, but for myself, I, I was just bored throughout most of it because because I wasn't laughing really at all. 
there's my review for Game Night. Uh, if you liked it, awesome. Uh, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Um, <laughs> sorry that I didn't really discuss a whole lot in this review. Uh, there's just nothing to talk about because when you uh, review a comedy, it kind of limits how much you can actually talk about because if you liked it, uh, then you don't want to spoil any of the jokes. And another reason is that, as I said earlier, com comedy's humor is very subjective. And uh, what I might might not find funny, some one of you guys might find it funny. And uh, what you find funny, I... Uh, what you might not find funny, I might find funny. I don't think I've said funny so many times. Funny, 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 chubby, funny, chubby, funny, chubby, funny. <laughs> okay, I'm done. Uh, if you enjoyed this review, be sure to leave a like and comment down below what you thought of Game Night down below. And... Follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and the Stardust app. Uh, that'll be in the description down below. Follow me there. And last but not least, subscribe to be a part of Foley Nation. And I'll see you when I get my next review up. And it's going to be for Annihilation. Starring Natalie Portman. And I'm excited to bring that to you guys. And thank you for watching and have a great day.